In this video, we will look at some of the functionalities offered by the OpenKM add-in for Microsoft Outlook. First, we will import two emails into the OpenKM repository. We select the emails and drag them to the target folder to do this. If we check the OpenKM interface and refresh, we will see that both emails have been successfully imported. Another way to import emails is to select a couple of emails again, go to the OpenKM tab, and click the Import button. From there, we navigate to the destination folder and confirm. Returning to the OpenKM interface and refreshing, we can now see that we have four emails. Another feature this add-in provides is importing only an email attachment from a specific email. To do this, we select the email, go to the OpenKM tab, and click Import Only Attachments. Next, we select the file we want to import, choose the destination folder, and complete the process. We can also add metadata, which we will skip in this case. Once done, return to the OpenKM interface and refresh it. We can see the attachment in the chosen folder. Another valuable add-in function is allowing us to attach a document from the OpenKM repository when sending an email. To do this, we create a new email, enter the recipient and subject, and go to the OpenKM tab. Now, the Add Attachments button is enabled, allowing us to navigate the repository and select the desired document. Once attached, we proceed to send the email. Finally, the add-in offers the option to send an email with a document that can only be viewed within the OpenKM repository. To configure this feature, we go to the OpenKM tab and the Settings menu. We select the repository directory where we want attachments to be intercepted and enable the Intercept Attachments option. There are three options, Do Not Intercept, Ask, where we will be asked to confirm interception, and Always, which intercepts automatically. In this case, we choose the Ask option and Save. With the configuration complete, we send an email with an attachment. When sending, we are asked if we want to replace the attachment, we select Yes. In the OpenKM interface, we can see the document classified by year, month, and day in the configured directory for intercepted files. Finally, when opening the email in our inbox, the attachment appears as a link redirecting to the OpenKM repository. For more information or any questions, feel free to contact us through our website form or via our social media.